Well, work's done for today. I'm so hungry, so maybe it's time for dinner. I've got some pork I bought yesterday, so I'm thinking of making ginger pork. I'm Sota Iemura, a 23-year-old freelance IT engineer. I lost my parents, and now I'm living alone in this old house. I hear a noise coming from the garden. Maybe a stray cat got in? I'm growing tomatoes and cucumbers in the garden, so I don't want them messed up. When I went to check, it wasn't a cat, but a person. An intruder? It's not like that. There's a reason for this. But with a hat, sunglasses, and a mask, you look like an intruder for sure. There's a reason for my appearance, too. I'm really sorry for coming onto your property without permission. I was desperately looking for a place to hide. She's definitely out of breath, and looks like she was in a hurry to hide. If she were a thief, she'd probably have lockpicking tools or a bag. And she looks more suspicious than malicious. It seems like she's got some kind of situation. So... I don't really get it, but do you want to wait at my place until you're safe from whoever you're running from? Is that okay? I did enter your garden without permission. Yeah. You look like you're in trouble. So I decided to hear her out and find out what was going on. Thanks for hiding me. Actually, I've been chased by weekly magazines and it's been tough. Huh? Weekly magazines? Did you do something bad? No, I haven't done anything. I just talked to a guy and now the weekly magazines are following me around. Oh, I'm supposed to take off everything since we're inside, so don't be surprised. Okay. She then took off her mask and hat. You should get it by now, but let me introduce myself just in case. I'm Nano Mitsumine. Huh? What do you mean by, you should get it? I'm Sota Iemura. Seriously? You don't know who I am? Sorry. Have we met somewhere before? No, we haven't met before, but it's not about that. I'm an actress. I'm on a morning dramas and variety shows. You really don't know who I am? Uh, no. I don't watch TV. Ah, so you're being chased by weekly magazines because you're famous? There are people in Japan who don't know me. Sorry. I'm just not interested in anything other than work. But I guess you really are famous. Don't try to make excuses. It just makes things worse. What is this person? This is definitely the type of person I've never met before. Anyway, you did help me, so I'll do something to thank you. How about I give you my autograph? No, I don't need any paper for it. And I don't know you, so I don't need it. I haven't really done much, and I wouldn't know if it's worth anything. It's my handwritten autograph! It's worth at least tens of thousands if you sell it! No, you shouldn't sell autographs. Well, it's worth that much. What? What's up with this? No interest in an actress right in front of you? What's going on? Is it possible that I'm just not his type at all? It's fine, but it's a bit frustrating. I've got a good idea. I left without my smartphone, so can I borrow yours? I need to call my manager. Oh, sure. But do you remember the phone number? Thanks. I only remember my manager's and my family's numbers. I'll pretend to dial the number and check his search history. He 
He's probably searching for Gravre or cute 2D characters. I'll see what his type is. Well, what's this? He only searches for work-related stuff. And a few cooking recipes. Did you accidentally press something weird? No, it's fine. This guy really isn't interested in idols or actresses. I've seen enough. There's no point in looking further. For now, I'll call my manager. Hello, it's Mitsumine. Yeah. I'm using someone else's phone. I'm all set, so no need to pick me up today. Huh? Does she not need a ride? Yeah. I'll grab a taxi for work tomorrow and head over from there. 8 a.m. at Tokyo Station. Got it. But can you bring me a change of clothes from the office? Sorry, but I need you to bring them. Thanks for lending me your phone. Here's the payment for the phone usage. No, no, it didn't cost 10,000 yen. I can't accept it. Then think of it as a lodging fee. Huh? What do you mean? Can I stay at your place? Huh? Why's that? Aren't you the one who asked for a ride? I changed my mind. I'm curious about what kind of person you are since you don't know me. I don't really know how to respond to that. Are you married or living with someone? No, I'm alone. Then it's not a problem. By the way, what do you do for work? I'm a freelance IT engineer. I'm done with work for today, though. That's fine, then. In that case, I'm hungry, so let's go buy dinner. It's not just that. And I really don't want to go to the nearby convenience store with someone who looks like a suspicious person. Yeah, you get a lot of weird looks around here. In that case, I'll buy dinner by myself. I forgot my smartphone, but I have my wallet, so I'll treat you. No, that's a bit much. Hmm, then what should we do? Can I open your fridge? Sure, but wouldn't it be better if you just went home? There are eggs and natto here. I'll make natto and egg rice for you. Isn't that just mixing it all together? I can only cook it and in instant noodles, you see. Then I'll cook. Natto and egg rice isn't exactly a satisfying dinner. Wait, you can cook? Yeah, I've been living alone for quite a while now. Is ginger pork potato salad and pork soup okay? Wait! Usually I just get TV station bento or convenience store bento, so I'm looking forward to it. I see. That's not really good for your health. Yeah. I think so too. But I'm bad at cooking, and since I've been living alone since I moved here, it's just how I turned out. Yeah, that's how it is for a working person. If she's a famous actress, she must be really busy. I've heard that filming dramas takes a lot of time. So I gave in to her insistence and reluctantly decided to cook. Wow, that looks delicious! You can just sit and wait. I'd feel bad if I got sauce on your clothes. I like watching people cook. Yeah, I get that. I used to watch my mom cook and sneak tastes when I was little. Nostalgic. I should have asked my mom to teach me more about cooking back then. Hmm, so you had a cute face too. Of course. Uh, by the way, did you just call me Sota? Yeah. Is that not okay? 
It's fine. I'm surprised you remembered my name. I only said it once. Oh, I guess it's because of my job. I tried hard to remember the names of the staff and fans, and I got good at remembering names over time. That's impressive. <laughs> right? Did you change your opinion of me? I thought she was just overly confident, but maybe she's actually someone who works really hard. Yeah, I did. You're really dedicated. It's kind of embarrassing to be praised so straightforwardly like that. Oh, since I'm not good at cooking, I'll at least help by getting the dishes. Is she embarrassed or something? Her face is cute, but she also looks adorable when she's embarrassed. She's an actress, but this doesn't seem like acting, right? Wow! I got careless and overcooked it! I'll make this one for myself. Mitsumine, it's ready. Thanks. Feel free to call me Nano. I'm probably younger than you. Got it. I'll call you Nano then. Okay. Since you went through the trouble of making this, let's eat it since it's still warm. Yeah, let's do that. Thinking about it, it's been a while since I've had a meal with someone. Wow, that's delicious! You're a genius! Thanks. I've only made this for myself, so I'm happy to be praised. I see. You live alone, huh? Is your family home? I'm not sure if it's okay to ask, but where are your parents? They died in an accident three years ago. Before that, my mom used to cook for me, so I was bad at cooking back then. I see. So you've been doing your best on your own since then. Yeah. I just had to do it, so I worked hard. I think that's admirable. Is that so? Thanks for saying that. I've been working hard on my own since my parents died, but being praised makes it feel like my efforts are worth it. And even though it's my usual cooking, it tastes better when we eat it together. After that, we had dinner together and washed the dishes. So, what do we do now? Do you have any games? I have some old ones, but wouldn't it be better if you went home? I still want to stay here. You probably won't do anything weird. That's true. Plus, I want to get to know you better. Just for today, let me stay over. So I ended up giving in to her enthusiasm and letting her stay over. Thanks for the bath and the pajamas. I definitely didn't want to sleep in that outfit, so it's a big help. Even if it's by chance, is it okay to see an actress like this? Use this room for now. Since you don't have a smartphone, use this alarm clock. Okay. Thanks. You're very thoughtful. I'll leave here around 7 and catch a taxi. I'll wake up around 6. Got it. I'll wake up around then too, so have breakfast before you leave. We slept in separate rooms. The next morning... Good morning! Oh, it smells delicious! Yeah, it's just about done. Thanks. It's nice to have this kind of thing. I live alone away from home now. And even when I lived with my parents, they were always busy, so we never had family meals together. I see. Well, it's not anything special, but let's eat together. Yeah. After that, we had breakfast, and she got ready to leave. I called a taxi to pick you up at the park, so if you use the back exit, you won't be too noticeable. Just be careful on your way home. Thanks a lot. Can I come back here and have a meal sometime? Sure. It's a nice coincidence after all. But be careful when you come. Got it. See you again. She left as quickly as she had arrived. I'm alone in this house again. 
Well, this is my everyday life, so I shouldn't have any strange expectations. But maybe before she comes back in a few weeks or months, I'll learn a few new recipes. That's what I was thinking, but the next day... Hey... What? Aren't you coming too soon? It's fine. Besides, I'm well prepared this time. Can I leave my cosmetics and shampoo here? Huh? Are you staying again today? Yeah. This place is really comfortable. Uh, just do whatever you want. Since then, she started coming over frequently and even helped with house cleaning. Sota, I finished cleaning the second floor. Thanks. I feel like it's become routine for her to help out, but is it okay to have an actress do this? I like doing this, so it's fine. And since coming here and meeting you, I've started to think it's not so bad to be treated like a special person. I see. But I'll definitely show my appreciation in my own way. Awesome! Then please treat me to a feast today. Got it. Leave it to me. Then we went on with our usual routine of eating and relaxing. Hey, Sota. It's been about two months since we first met, hasn't it? Yeah. You've pushed me into spending more time together, but I didn't realize it had been that long. It sounds like you're complaining about it. No, I don't feel that way. It's fun to have some noise after being alone for so long. Hmm... It feels like I'm your pet or something. No, no. That doesn't quite fit either. So, do you have feelings like I'm your girlfriend or wife? Yeah, maybe that's the case. Don't just give a half-hearted answer. I said it's okay not to treat me as special, but I don't like being treated casually. You're difficult. So, is there something you want me to do? Hmm. Let's go somewhere fun, like an amusement park. No, it's too crowded and problematic. Cheap. It's not about being cheap. You have to be patient about that. I know, but sometimes I want to meet outside the house. Well, maybe a private restaurant where we can meet up would be okay. Hmm, then maybe we don't need to go. Because your cooking is the best. I see. Thanks. Yeah. But I still want to ride roller coasters. No way. That's a definite no. Because disguises won't hold up. She kept coming over to my place frequently, but after three months of knowing her, one day... Got it. Sorry. I'll make sure to convey my thoughts properly at the press conference. Is there some trouble going on? Hey, can you take a look at this? What's wrong? Is there a problem? Yeah, my manager just sent me a photo. Could this be... Yeah. It's a photo of you leaving my place, taken by the paparazzi. It looks like the agency got notified before it got published in the magazine. This is bad, isn't it? It says, Mitsumine Nano, leaving a regular person's house. And revealed love affair with a regular person? Yeah, it's bad. But you seem pretty calm about it. Once it's been taken, there's nothing you can do. Even if we ask, they probably won't retract it. Even though we're not actually dating, the headline is exaggerated. A lot of people might believe it. So I decided to hold a press conference before the article comes out. It's from this afternoon, so it'll probably be in the news by tonight. I see. If it's out in the open, then our relationship is probably over. It was quite fun being with her, and now it's going to be lonely again. But it's just going back to how things were a few months ago. But maybe I can't go back to that anymore. Nano, uh... Can I declare at the press conference that we're dating? What does that mean? We're not actually dating, right? That's true. But if they have a photo of us leaving the house in the morning, people won't believe otherwise. I like you, so... I was thinking we might as well just declare that we're dating. Is that okay with you? 
It's not that I don't want to. I like you too. I see. And I'll say we're dating. Yeah, got it. But can I say something first? Huh? Being with you has become important to me, without me even realizing it. And I've enjoyed our time together. So will you be my girlfriend? Yeah, of course. I like you too. Alright, then to make our relationship comfortable, I'll first do my best at the press conference. It's a bit hectic and I'll probably be back late at night, but could you prepare some food for me? Your cooking makes me feel better. Yeah, leave it to me. There will be various challenges if we start dating, but I believe we can overcome them together. Thank you for watching. How was today's video? Please check out our other videos as well.